Today I'm going to show you how to uh, grout dry stack tile. I went online and couldn't find anybody to do it, so here we go. I'm actually grouting this up today. See, that's already grouted. But let me show you how this guy, this is not my work, but you see how he grouted his? Look at those joints. That's sanded. He should have used unsanded. I bet you'd even seal his stuff. So before I even attempted this, I used 511, and I brushed it on and wiped it off, and I put two coats on this stuff. And now I'm using Customs non-sanded grout. So I'm going to let you watch me do this. Hope I can get this just right for you guys. Yeah, let me see. Then you can watch me. There you go. Let me see if my thumb works the best. If you don't believe it, is use your hand. That work seems to work the best. You know? Don't go too far. Sure you want a glove. Yeah, make sure you get every little nook and cranny. Alright? Really get it in there. When you, all your things are full. I'm just going to use up all this drop. Remember, seal it with the 511. Like I said, I, I did two coats on this stuff, so. All right. Okay. Clean your hands. Then, make sure you got a lot of clean water, too. Then I bought this grout trowel at Home Depot and just, you know, try to get off as much as you can off the tile, right? Get that bottom joint. Try to get it as much as you can. You know? I even use this side of the trowel. Try to get it all off, you know? Normally I'd edit this video, but I'm going to let you guys watch me do this one little section to really see how I'm doing it. Like I said, I looked all over the internet how to grout dry stack, how to grout dry stack tile, how to grout dry stack stone, how to grout dry stack slate. And you know what? I didn't see any videos doing this, so that's why I thought it was. I'm doing this off my tablet as we speak. I got no tripod for it, so. Not the best, I'm sorry. But like I said, if you wanna grout dry stack, this is the video for you. Make sure you get all the stuff and I'll start setting up. So just do your do your best to clean it all with your grout trowel. And like I said, you get this at at Home Depot. You know? I'm just checking my camera angles when you don't see me working. 
I'll put this here to make sure you... Okay, let me twist it a little bit. Let me... There you go, that's a better, better angle. So now we can really go to town. The cleaner you get it, the easier it's going to be. Don't worry about it, as long as you got two coats of seal on here, you're good to go. You don't wait too long, you'll be good. Look at it. I even got another top trial, see? This one's an old, a little stiffer. But if you only have that one from Home Depot, make sure it's brand new. Don't get a, don't use an old one, it's got to be brand new. You know? This stuff's starting to set up just right. Right? Yeah. Like you said, if I were you and you've never done this, I would I would do a little section like this at a time, about this big, just to get the hang of it. I've been doing this for over 30 years, so this is my first time doing this. You never go out dry stack. But see now this guy had it in the shower. He wanted it grouted, so now to match all the stuff. We gotta grout it all. Like I said, I've never done it. It's my first time. You're truly gay Blake. I'm a licensed tile contractor in the state of California. Stationed out of San Jose, California. Don't be afraid to use your fingers. Make sure you glove you got some good gloves. These are already getting torn up. Make sure you wear gloves, it's not going to be hate and hurt. So, I know it's going to be a long video, but it'll be worth you guys. Alright? Okay. I think I got it all I want. It's all set up nice. Alright, I'm getting as much off as I can. Squeezy it, basically. Alright? Use anything you can to get out the grout. See? That's why this works so good. It's about the size of the tile, thickness right here. See? No, I think you're going different color in here too, so it's another thing I gotta do, but today we're just routing this dry stack as quick as we can. It's a Saturday. Nobody else is out on the job site except for another tile man. He's downstairs doing glass tile. Yeah. You got that one? Now's the time to wash it. Yellow sponge gets these in the tile department. And you just basically clean it up now. All right? Right. Like I said, do not go too far. The stuff setting up pretty good, even with the sealer on there. Right. Because if you're going to get juice, make sure you turn off the power. Then I wouldn't have no lights in here. So I taped up mine, but still, you get juiced. I've been electrified. Nice little 110 jolt while I'm grouting away. Hit that point. Right? I've done that. See how beautiful this is looking? Good. Look at that. And it's working. But remember, 511. You have to seal it. I recommend 511 you get at Home Depot. It's a miracle product. I seal all my stone and tile with it. You know? Yes, it comes right off. As long as you don't wait too long, I'm going to do a better job than that other guy. Right? Just clean it off. 
And I'll show you another little trick, a little tool. You might have one, or maybe not. All right. Yeah, beautiful. Uh, I'll show you. This is video probably running off. This right here. See? It gets all your little corners. See? It's just a chisel or anything small that fits in the sky. See? You clean up all your little joints here. See? Just a chisel or a piece of wood or anything. Can any little joint. Right. And that's how the grout dries that tile or stone, whatever. Because you don't want to end up like this. Check this out. See, this was done by another guy. So. See how crude it is? Look at that. Crude. Now come look at mine. Right? Let it spo see that? Nice and clean. So, I got to go. I got to keep going, but have a great day. And look out for all my videos. Hit the subscribe below. Hit like, share with all your friends on Facebook, whatever. So have a great day and a blessed day.